Hey everybody, we're back on Fresh Land 4. Welcome to episode 4. So far it's here and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Before we get into this video, i just like to say, yeah, the bee farm, working great. I'm liking it. Um, also, asked a question in my last video, what should I call this fella? And thus far I've only gotten two responses and... I'm sorry, all but Polly, really. Um, I don't know. That's my wife's favorite out of the names, so we'll see. But <laughs> but anyways, talking about all, uh, me and Ultimus asked me a week, like a week ago. I can't. I'm not sure if he was doing a stream that he turned into a video, or if he was just recording for a video, but. Yeah, we he needed some help in the nether, and I went along to help him out. And without any further ado, I'm going to show you what happened through my eyes. So as the sun sets and I tend my bees, let me tell you a little story. So yeah, I'm I'm in the nether. Wow, with with Ultimus, and we're going to uh, Ultimus wants to build a. A farm, a blaze farm. So he asked for some muscle, somebody to protect him, and I've already been today, shot twice. <laughs> today we're just going to cover it. I'm going to come back and actually make it later. I just want to cover it today. That's today that, a covering day. That's cool. Well, watch out! There's there's a big hole here. Don't don't jump down yet. No, no, not me. Uh, I don't normally jump without. I jump without looking. I thought it was no, 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 no. You, you don't. Wasn't. You don't jump without looking. Not, not in the Nether. I do. <laughs> no, I learned that. The, had, had the first test on the server. <laughs> I learned that the hard way. Uh, hang on. Whoa. Yeah, I almost jumped into the hole. Um, I need to dispatch this man. Oh, there's a blaze spawner right there, too. I can see the fence. Oh, oh, shoot. That's, that's the blaze spawner right that way. Right. Right there, right over there. Oh, 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 oh yeah, buddy. I thought uh, you said there was a double. There was around here. I'm not sure if this is one or if it was a different area. Because remember, I, I did. Oh, there it is. There's two. Oh, yeah, there's two right here. One, two. Wow, dude. And, and we got a friend coming towards us. And, of course, I got, uh, infected. Yeah. We <laughs> ah! Okay. I'm eating my food. Okay, so how am I going to handle this? Which one do I want? Do I want the one in front of me? Or do I want the one to the side? Which one do I want? That's the question. I'm good. All right. Uh, I'm I, gonna go for the one straight across and make a run for it and start blocking it off. We'll see what happens here. All right. Uh, I'm I'm burning. I'm burning. Uh. Yeah. There. All right. This is not gonna be fun. I guess now you know why I need muscle here. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, almost. Oh, yeah, baby. Okay, retreat, retreat. Oh, my God. Wow, I come around the corner. They're shooting me from way over there. Yeah, I should have made myself a slight. Oh, gassed. Gassed. Too. Oh, not anymore. The one in front of me because it has a covering above it, so I don't have to use as much cobble to cover. That's probably why I took this one. I can sort of get away with a little bit. Ow, and he got me. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that we. Thing spawned like crazy. I'm 
have to go for it again. Just go for it. Whoa. Because really, all you have to do is do the top. Once you do the top, you can do the bottom stuff easy. Because what happens is they only they can only spawn above the spawner. They, they can't spawn below a spawner. made this kind of safe here if you want to come this way uh, there's a guy off to the way off over there I took care of him he was shooting at you I kind of made this a little bit safe here so hopefully I got my boxes in here Oh, dude, you should have told me you were eating potatoes. I could have given you some steaks. Yeah, potatoes are fine. I'm going to box this in here just to keep stuff away from us. Hey. Right. All right, there we go. And now the hard part is going to be blocking that spawner off because this is where they're going. This way we don't have to deal with these ones in front of us. We don't have to deal with the other ones behind us now. All right. You're clear. Oh. Uh, no, I'm not. Ow. Oh no! Did you die? Nope. Nah. I did. Yeah, I, I saw that. Alright. I'm in. I've got it all covered up all in, inside the fence and two above it. Whoa! I'm, I'm, trying, I'm, trying, I'm trying to put a uh, chest down. That's alright. I, I was All of a sudden I went down. I was like, oh boy. Ha ha ha! Cabo. I want to put stuff in here I don't need. Right There's now. your armor. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not, yeah, I should probably put the armor on because that at least helps me a little bit. Uh, a little bit of potatoes on me. Oh, my ender eye. I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, everything. Okay. That That's what I picked up. I don't know if I got all the cobble. I was more worried about your armor and stuff. Right. Oh, my God. It's a war zone out here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you don't realize if you leave the box. Once you leave the box, you realize what's actually going on out there. <laughs> Never leave the safety of the box. <laughs> Whoa. Are you good? You got, you got gas too? Yeah, I should be, I should be all right. If I die, I, know, I have my stuff. I know where my stuff is. I don't have... I just have my armor. I can remake my armor if I have to. It's just iron armor. It's no big deal. Oh, should be good. Oh, are you planning on using this other spawner or not? Uh, probably not. If you want to take it out, you can. Because we have this one. So if you want to take that one out, just to make it easier. I, it's either that or if make a double. Is there? If they're close enough to make a double. Yes. Yeah, we could. We could do a double. I'm not blocking my floor off again. This looks like too much fun. Yeah, blaze farms are all right, but I got to tell you, man. Um, if you get like a double spawner, spider spawner, t two of them, oh my God. The, the XP is just crazy. It so really is. Rods for things too, I, I like making lots of um, um, endo rods. Oh. All right. Yeah. That's what I use them for. I use them for making my end rods. See. And I make lots of end rods. It's one of my favorite. Next, next to sea lanterns, it's my favorite uh, light block. Yeah, I mean, mine too. Sea lanterns is my favorite. Well, I don't know. Now you have lanterns, so. <laughs> I don't really care for the lantern myself. I, I I, eh, in the right place, they, they work good. You're making a modern build, sea lanterns all the way. Um, what I would like is to have, like, Glowstone be more like the texture of a sea lantern, but yellow. But hey, I, I, I win a lot. You know, I want, let's see, slabs and stairs for every single block in the game. Well, see, I want vertical slabs. I want them too. 
You know, I'd like vertical stairs, too. I know that sounds kind of crazy, but I was building my mob farm in my single-player world. I could so have used, like, a vertical step at, at, at one point. So, you know, like, if you wanted to frame something out, you could do it on the bottom and the top, but you can't do it on the sides. I mean, there's got to be... I don't see how hard that would be to do. I, I mean, I'm not a programmer or anything, so I, I really don't know, but it seems like they got a bunch of smart people there that could figure that out. <laughs> Here's the idea to figure it out. Exactly. Now, I mean, slabs and stairs for everything. I mean... They put, they gave us concrete and didn't give us any variance to it. That shame on them. Um, but I've already like dirt blocks. Can you imagine dirt and grass blocks, stairs and slabs? Oh my God, landscaping would be so much better and easier. Um, glass. I've tried to make glass staircases before, and it's really, really hard to do without. A glass step. I mean, I kind of did it one time. I used uh, glass blocks and birch slabs. And I alternated it. So it was kind of a glass staircase. <laughs> but when you start making these modern builds... They have a lot of that in an actual modern home, you know, glass staircases, open type staircases and stuff. I don't think we're asking too much. All right. Around the corner over here. Well, that's not the corner. That's not a corner, I don't think. This is the corner, I believe. Ah, uh, no, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Uh. Oh my god. Right. Well, <laughs> I'm going to meet you up front in just a second. I tried swimming in lava to save the blaze. Okay. Yeah. That's exactly what I did. Knocked me into the lava. This time, because everything's there, I put it in the chest. And I'm coming to make sure there's a hole for me to get in when I come. All right. Whoa. There we go. Now let's see, where did I put that chest? There it is. Go. I've been trying to finish these walls a little bit, so. <laughs> Alright. Say what happens is knock me backwards off this platform here. in next time. All right. Ah, I see where they are. Okay. They're right above us. All right. Um, unless, they, unless they change spawn mechanics, they cannot spawn below the spawner. Uh, He's looking right at me. Get back there. Usually I make some fire resistance potions by now. Yeah, that would maybe have been smart. Yeah, we got to find some slimes to do that, or find the um, those uh, um, magma, magma, so you can get some magma creams. Right. Because you make you can make magma creams with um, uh, slimes or with the magma uh, things. I 
Here I come. Oh, you're there. <laughs> that was the wrong spot. I was just trying to seal this up a little bit more. And take care of this troublemaker. Whoa. Okay, I can stand out there for a bit, but <laughs> that you need, you need fire resistance armor, which I haven't got any fire resistance books yet. Yeah, me I neither. I haven't got any fire resistance books yet. Oh, fishing! I haven't even started that yet. I did buy a bunch of books from Winter earlier today. Um, a looting for my sword and some mending for my armor and. Okay, I'm healed up. Let me go out there and see if I can. There he is. He's off to your right. Oh, Mike. No, uh, he went down. Oh. All right. I'm pretty good. Um, I think we're clear. Uh, no, we're not. No, we're not. Back up. Ow, ow. Okay. You're really upsetting me. Whoa. There we go. How did you get in here? Because oh, ow. Because I this top here is still down too low. It's not down where we are yet. That's why. I gotta bring this top down. That's why I'm that's what I'm working on. Oh, gonna die, gonna die, gonna die. Let me get by. I can get him. Voila. So yeah, I think we just destroyed the other spawner. 
as much as I'd like to do a double here. <laughs> Okay, so you want me to start taking some of this uh, nether brick out? Not yet. I want to make sure that we have everything fully enclosed here first, all the way out to the edges. All right. Then we can do that. All right. So I want to make this a little bit safer this way, too. So I'm just going to go boom, boom, boom. All right. And have this come out this way a little. All right. Where's the spawner at? So it's know. right above me. Okay. One. Ah. You can push that might have been me, sorry. Okay, so I want to count this. Uh, I'm going to count this. Right. One, two, three, four. Okay, this is our this is our wall here. So our wall comes this way. And we go this way. Make sure this way is clear. I'm just doing this so I can make sure everything's the way it's supposed to be as far as how far out we are no. from this thing. Okay. Where am I here? Okay, here I am. Alright, so spawner's there. So this is one, two, three, four. Wait, is that five, four? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. One. One. Two. Okay, the wall's four. Okay. Wall is four. All right. And this one, two, three, four. Okay, there we go. That's four. All right, let me count the next way. Okay, and then we count this one, I think, already. One, two, three, and the wall's four, yep. Uh, this wall is four, right? One, two, one, two, three, four, yep. One, two, three, yep. And then there should be three for count here. One, two, three, all right. And everything should now be enclosed. In cobble. No, I can actually work on the spawner next time I'm on. That takes care of this episode. It was a long episode. <laughs> I have to edit, out, edit out quite a bit, but you know. <laughs> at least we got it done. That's that's the thing. Yeah, buddy. All right. I'm gonna put this here like this. Okay. Door here. All right. So let's <laughs> take this out. Move it. Here. I want to make this a little wider just to make it so we know where our doorway is going to be. Do we need anything lit up in here? Nah. You don't need a light up inside the nether. Alright, so that's that. Okay. You know, I heard somewhere if you light things up, you won't get wither skeletons. Really? Yep. That will. Lighting up a fortress will make your wither skeletons not spawn. I, that. yeah, I heard that just All right, so this is recently, I don't remember where, but. Okay, and then we got, well, 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 and well, there's our doorway. And this is, I'm leaving this center just so I can know where that is, so I know how to make my thing. And I think we're good for today. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, I just hey, torched it. Okay. Just so you know where the middle is. <laughs> and so I could freak you out. <laughs> Alright, so that's good. Alright, so I'm going to put all this other cobble in here because I have to put more cobble down for when I'm going to build the rest of it. Oh, boy. My picks in here too. And that's all. That's it for today. Thank you, sir, for helping me out with this. Oh, no problem. Now I have to go and try to find some soul sand. <laughs> Oh, there's tons of it. I passed by tons of it on the way here. 
So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode with me and Ultimus in the Nether. It was a blast working with him. I had so much fun. I wish I could say that uh, I protected him a little bit better. Um, we, we learned some valuable lessons here. We, we learned that Ultimus is a pretty good sport and he dies often, so he has to be. Uh, we also learned that he can count to four. And he did that very well several times. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I don't know. Ever since then, I've I've had this really weird feeling in my head. It's, it's something's just totally off. And I'm not quite sure. Um, uh-oh. I think Soful needs to go see a doctor. Um, I may have been stung by a bee. Oh, yeah. And remember, name the parrot. I need names for the parrot. So come on, people. Give me some good, solid names for the parrot. Otherwise, I guess it's going to be Polly. So come on. Rally up. Get those names coming in. So, yeah, this is where I'm going to wrap this video up today. And as always, please consider subscribing if you're not already a subscriber. And hit that like button for this video. I would truly appreciate both. Ring that bell so you get notified the next time I upload a video. And from Soulful to you, thanks for watching and have an absolutely amazing day, dudes and dudettes. Bye.